One is it's part of interphase. It's it is regular the regular life of the cell. And G1 it grows. It makes more organelles. Next is S phase, in synthesis. which we synthesize. We double the DNA. G2, the cell grows even larger, gets ready for mitosis. Now we're done. Now. Into chromosomes, we can see the nuclear membrane begins to disappear, the nucleus disappears. What's the, this? the what's, so, what's this? Okay, nucleolus, uh, the spindle fibers begin to grow, and as it goes on farther, these will begin to line up. Okay, however, we're not done with prophase until these actually connect. Once they connect to the different sister chromatids. We are done with prophase and we have metaphase. And that's all metaphase is, lining up in the middle and attaching spindle fibers. Now, anaphase is when these begin to be pulled apart. The two sister chromatids are pulled apart into separate identical chromosomes. So these begin to pull them to the opposite side. And that's anaphase, A4 apart. And once they get way over here, we're done with anaphase. With anaphase. When, no, when telophase is, these are going to disconnect and begin to disappear. The everything happened, the nuclear membrane reappears. We'll get a nucleolus. And these disappear. They relax and they're no longer can see them. Now at the same time this is happening, this begins to pitch off. Cytokinesis? And that's cytokinesis. When cytokinesis to continue, these will be separated. It's, it's splitting up all the things, and we just continue until there are two new cells. And we call these daughter cells because they are identical cells. And they're going to be half the size of the original cell. Then they'll grow to the size of the original cell, then make and then they'll go through mitosis. Okay? That's okay. it. That's it. So now what it is is each one of you